Hello, my name is Brandon Leonard, and I'll be showing you how to get into a wireless router and get the web key. This is for my security 110B class at Davidson County Community College. We'll start off um, in a minute. First things first, I'm using Backtrack 5 and VirtualBox on Windows XP. I'm also using a wireless USB per, um, adapter, which is what you'll need for VirtualBox or VM Player. The first thing you want to do, open up a terminal. Go to airmon-ng. This will bring up a list of um, interfaces. As you can see, we have a WLAN, a um, wide wireless let, um, local area network. It is a my Realtek RTL8187L. Once you have figured out which um, interface you're going to use, you'll simply do an air mon ng start. And then whatever interface you're going to use. I will be using a WLAN 0. What this will do is this will turn on the monitor mode. As you can see, we now have the monitor mode enabled. Our next step is to do a arrow dump hyphen ng mon zero. This will bring up a list of the wireless connections that are being captured. Once you find yours, simply hit control C. This is mine. Um, two things to remember your channel number and the BSS ID. Best thing to do with that, right click and copy. Next thing I'll do is open up a new terminal. Do another arrow dump, hyphen ng, space hyphen w, then space web. This is the um, wireless protocol we're using. You do another minus c. This is the channel that we found previously. Mine was 6, so I put 6 in. Then hyphen hyphen BSSID. Now here is where copying that big long number came in handy. You simply click, right click, paste. Then mon 0. This will bring up the data transfer station. Once you have this up, it's better to wait for bigger numbers but you can go ahead. I'm going to go ahead personally. The for next thing we're going to do is a airy play hyphen ng negative one space zero space minus a space and then we'll paste that big long number again. This is the BSS ID. Mon zero. Hit enter and now once we scroll down here you can see that the authentication has been successful we're up to 162 data you can minimize the last one we're going to do another airy play hyphen ng minus three net b and then for the last time paste the BSS ID now this will start packet reading the next step actually requires you to wait we must wait for the data which is currently at 300 almost to reach roughly three to five thousand minimum Now at almost 400 data, we have about 26,000, 2600 to go. 
We're getting two data points a second. Three now. Rising up to almost 500 a second. Still only to a second with 485 data. Now we notice that the data is going up more. It's up to almost 550 data points. We're still only two um, points a sec two points a game away. <coughs> now it's 600. We're now up to almost 650 data. jump forward just a little bit <clears throat> we're now at um, 2000 data still rising rapidly the next thing we'll do whenever it gets to 3000 is open up another terminal and what we will do here is a <clears throat> simple command it's the last command that we'll be doing for this particular video and this particular project all you do is a air crack is the name of it and it's air crack hyphen ng space <coughs> um, web hyphen o one dot cap and simply hit enter this is a very time consuming thing so you might have to sit here for a while As you can see now, it is testing for a key. <clears throat> We're going to look at the data stream, see where it's at.
now up to 20,000 data points. This is where most scholars will tell you to wait and start the air crack. This is one of the better areas instead of waiting at till three to five thousand. Now up to twenty one thousand data points. Now up to twenty two thousand. Still working. Twenty four thousand data. Up to twenty five thousand data points now. Now up to twenty six thousand data points. <laughs> 